Hey guys, this is Alex at Finding Wholesomeness. Our own mindset and understanding will stop us from doing what God wants us to do. We say, I'm not willing to go past my fears. I'm not going willing to go past my comfort zone. We make up a lot of excuses for not doing things. God, I can't do that. I'm not the right person. I can't do that. I'm not good at that sort of thing. But we forget that God is incapable of making mistakes. And if he chose you to do something specific, then that's probably what you were meant to do. It's not your plan for your life. It's God's plan for your life. We worry. We fear a lot. We think that our plan is better because we don't like to rely on other people, not even God. We like to think that we want to lead. We want to make the decisions. But we don't realize that when we do this, when we live lives, when we live our lives for ourselves, we are missing out on the most important opportunity for our lives, which is the opportunity to follow God. We might see all the disadvantages to that. Oh, I don't have as much money now. I won't be able to be as comfortable. I might have to give up things. But God's plan for your life is the best plan for your life. And it turns out that if you commit to it, you won't need any of that other stuff. You have a choice right now. You can either continue living life how you want to live life, or you can obey God, listen with your heart, and start following. The choice has always been yours. So are you going to follow your plan or God's plan? Thanks for watching. This is Alex at Finding Wholesomeness, signing out. Bye.